Okay, YouTube, I watched a lot of videos on how to change your distributor cap uh, and distributor system, actually. And I didn't find, I had watched dozens of them just to actually figure it out because no one gave full length detail front to back. So that's what I'm going to try to do. I've got here a 2001. Got a 5.7 liter Vortec in it, and this is a Express 350. In case anyone's wondering, same engine, five sevens are all the same. But first, start top dead center, and the easiest way to do that is your little timing mark on here, which mine is right there. You line the timing mark with this right over here which you can't see too well but right up in there is basically I don't know if you call it timing key that's what I call it but that's how you know how to find top dead center And then, come in here, shut the door, don't get all the buzzing. So this is the entire dis distributing system. So you take this out, this bolt, and this key, holds it in place. This slides up. Um... If you align, I'll show you here. This is the old one I just took out. See these two dots right here? Um, you align those two with the mark that is on here, which this is the old one. It just has this tiny little G, whatever you want to call it. So you would align. Align it like this. Then the same way it went out, comes new one goes in. Mine came out like this, so I put it in like this. But couldn't get my oil pump uh, to align. I couldn't get it to seat all the way down in, so I took a long screwdriver like this and a flashlight and just shine her down in here with this out. And you can turn it to wherever you need it. But, problem was I had... I didn't know where to turn it to. So, basically it's just, it was a guessing game for me. I would just turn a little bit, slide this down in, and if everything lined up, I was good. If not, take it back out, turn a little more, put it back down in. Until I finally got it. Took me about three hours. So, hopefully, this video helps and we'll cut down on time for everyone else. Um, let's see. Mine, I aligned this bolt with the wing, the screw right here on the cap. And my... Uh, whatever you call a thing, my rotor, the actual rotor, um, I'll show you here. So, This thingy, right here, it's in your rotor, should be pointing at cylinder one, which should be actually the prong of cylinder one, which I didn't know that, no one told me. And if you can see, this is cylinder one, and the prong is actually right here. Not right here. So, that will actually help you uh, aligning it. 
goes like this. And so this, when it's installed, this right here should be pointing at cylinder one right here. So, so it should be sitting roughly like this when it's in. And these are spiraled as you see. So like my problem was I lined this in my two holes. But then when I seed it down in, this was not pointing at cylinder one. It'd be pointing at cylinder eight. So you have to have your oil pump down on the bottom, or the oil, whatever you call that thing, down on the bottom, turned just right so it seats. So when, it, when you set it down in, like so, so when you set it down in, actually, it should be like this. So when you set it down in, it'll actually spin and go down in and stop pointing at cylinder one and be seated all the way down. So hopefully this helps out everybody.